the second league meeting of the size this term with Dundalk winning 4-1 at the UCD Bowl back in April and it was the visitors who shocked the home side as in the second minute Chris Mulhall's free kick fairly flew into the back of the net and UCD had taken the lead but it wasn't long before Dundalk were levelled the equaliser coming in the sixth minute Curtis Byrne clipped the ball to Patrick Hoban who headed the ball home even he got a knock to the head from UCD keeper Connor McDonnell his eighth league goal of the season on the half hour, Dundalk hit the front. Darren Meenan's corner, Hoban made a nuisance of himself and Curtis Byrne nodded into the back post to make it 2-1 to Dundalk. Two became three just two minutes later as following a flicked cross from Hoban, Daryl Horgan found the net. Horgan's fourth goal in as many games. It got worse for UCD. Another goal from a set piece. Again, Meenan with the dead ball delivery. This time met by the head of Brian Gartland. Into the second half and Dundalk captain Andy Boyle was booked on 50 minutes for a foul on Mark Langtree. It was the prelude to a big talking point later in the game. UCD got one back on 75 minutes. Boyle fouled Killian Morrison and was booked for the second time in the half by referee Jim McKell. But the referee allowed him to stay on the pitch. The resultant penalty for UCD was fired high into the top corner by Robbie Benson to make it 4-2 to Dundalk. <laughs> Scoring wasn't finished yet, however, as Dundalk got a fifth before the end, and yet another penalty, Hoban scoring the spot kick to leave it 5-2 in the end for Dundalk.